Hi, my name is Missy Burden, and I am the owner of Sunny House Fine Art. My name is Greg Young, and I am co-founder of Sunny House Fine Art. This Sunny is uh, Swahili for artists. Uh, so this is the artist house. This is home for artists. This is home for collectors, people who just want to learn about fine art. My work uh, focuses on the social impacts of issues as they relate to African Americans and specifically African American females. The, the gallery was always part of my dream. But it was always a dream. Like, I'm that person that's like always thinking ahead about what it is I want to do next. I was always constantly running into issues about where I could show, how I could show. I've always been an independent artist. And so in my mind, I kept saying, I've got to figure out a way so that I can do it on my own terms, regardless of what the scenario is. I'm Jennifer Monet Cowley, and I'm an artist, a designer, and a curator. I think it's an honor. Um, to be represented in this particular gallery, uh, especially since it is black owned and the heart is into promoting black artists. Hi, I'm Dr. Valerie Gillespie and I love working with mixed media painting. One of the things that I love about Sonny House is that there's a relationship that happens with the artists and the gallery owners. They want to know about me. They want to know why I did what I did, why do I choose this specific color, what this piece means, and I think that that relationship is pretty much everything when it comes to gallery owners and artists working together. My name is Avita Tizano. I am a visual artist. I paint my own paper and I cut it up and I put it together like a puzzle. When you talk to a lot of people or you ask them who are the great artists, they always mention male artists. They hardly never mention female artists. So for us as African American women, it's very important for us to get that representation because we don't get it. My philosophy for collecting art is that you need to connect with it. Don't look for it to cost a certain amount because you can buy a piece that costs hundreds of dollars that can incite feelings in you that are priceless. As first time art buyers, you want to acquire the pieces that speak to you. 